In this video, I'm going to show you how you can share files and folders with other people using Proton Drive. Now, Proton Drive gives you two gigabytes of free storage or five gigabytes if you sign up for a new email. Now, this is useful if you use Proton Mail and you want to use their drive service as well. Now, to share files and folders with this, you need to first go to Proton Drive. To do this, just go to Google and type in Proton Mail, or you can go ahead and just type in Proton Drive. Either way though, you need to get to the Proton Mail website and log in. Now, once you have logged in, if you are doing it this way, you can then go to the apps and then you click Drive. Now, once you're here, you will get two gigabytes free. You can then go ahead and click New. And if you want to, you can upload files or folders. Now, if you wanna share these with someone, I like to just go New Folder and then give the folder a name. So let's say I'm sharing like work documents, right? I could just call it Work. And then inside this folder, we can go ahead and double click on it. And then if you go new, you can upload files and also folders. Now, I don't even do it this way. I just open up a file explorer and then you can kind of drag on whatever you want and highlight all of the folders, all of the files and just drag it in. From here, it will then upload those files and folders and you can go ahead and then just share this work folder. So I'm going to go back and here's the work folder, which we can right click and then click share. Now, from here, you can either invite people to either view, edit or download these files. So to do that, you can just invite people via their email, enter in their email here, and they will get an email asking them to join these files. You can also create a public link. If you click on this button, it will activate the public link. Then anyone with this link will be able to view these files. You can copy this link, you can send it to someone, and you can share the files via a link. And this is what it will look like on their end when they receive the link. They can click on it and they can download all of the files. So that's how you can share files with Proton Drive. I hope that helped you out.